After an illustrious career spanning over seven decades, Dick Van Dyke, now 98, shows no signs of slowing down. Contrary to assumptions, he's not living a quiet life, but instead is making a comeback with a guest spot in a popular TV show. His recent activities have been making headlines, prompting many to wonder about the source of his vitality. Van Dyke's journey began in 1925, where he was born in West Plains, Missouri. His love for performing started early, leading to a successful career in television, film, and theater. His roles in The Dick Van Dyke Show and Mary Poppins have become classics, enduring generations of audiences. Despite his age, Van Dyke remains active, challenging the stereotype of retirement. His story is a testament to the power of passion and the enduring appeal of a life dedicated to the arts. The question remains, what's next for this legendary actor? Dick Van Dyke was born on December 13, 1925, in Missouri, with dreams far removed from the careers of his stenographer mother and salesman father. From a young age, he found himself drawn to the allure of cinematic success. As he grew older, his aspirations shifted towards the burgeoning medium of television. Van Dyke's early years were filled with a love for performing, and he honed his skills in various forms of entertainment. He began his career as a radio announcer before transitioning to television, where he quickly made a name for himself as a talented actor and comedian. Despite his humble beginnings, Van Dyke's natural charisma and comedic timing propelled him to stardom. His work on classic television shows like The Dick Van Dyke Show and Diagnosis Murder cemented his place in television history and endeared him to audiences around the world. Throughout his long and storied career, Van Dyke has remained a beloved figure in the entertainment industry. His contributions to film and television have left an indelible mark on the industry, and his work continues to resonate with audiences today. Van Dyke's early aspirations may have been far removed from the careers of his parents, but his success in the entertainment industry is a testament to his talent and hard work. From his early days on the radio to his iconic roles on television, Van Dyke has proven himself to be a true entertainer, captivating audiences with his charm and wit for decades. Dick Van Dyke's passion for performance can be traced back to his high school days. During this time, he was an active member of the drama and a cappella clubs where he discovered his love for being on stage. These early experiences ignited a flame within him that would burn brightly for the rest of his life. However, his journey to becoming a successful actor was not without its challenges. When World War II broke out, Dyke dropped out of high school to join the Air Force. Unfortunately, he was initially rejected for being underweight. But that didn't stop him from entertaining the troops at home, where he honed his skills and gained valuable experience. Despite the setbacks, Dyke remained committed to his craft, and his hard work eventually paid off. He went on to become one of the most beloved actors in Hollywood, known for his iconic roles in films and shows such as Mary Poppins and The Dick Van Dyke Show. In the end, it was Dyke's unwavering dedication and passion for performance that made him a success. His story serves as a reminder that even in the face of adversity, we can all achieve our dreams if we believe in ourselves and never give up. After serving in the military during World War II, Dick Van Dyke ventured into radio during its golden age. He formed a comedy duo with Phil Erickson, which laid the groundwork for his future success in entertainment. The actor's talent for comedy was further honed in stage plays, leading him to star in productions such as Bye Bye Birdie and The Music Man. As television began to rise in popularity, Van Dyke seamlessly transitioned to the small screen. He secured a variety of TV roles, eventually becoming a household name with The Dick Van Dyke Show. This classic sitcom aired from 1961 to 1966 and showcased his impeccable comedic timing. Later, in the 1990s, he starred in Diagnosis Murder, where he played both an actor and a detective. In addition to his work in television, the actor has also made a significant impact in cinema. His film roles include notable works like Mary Poppins and Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. In Mary Poppins, he danced and sang his way into audiences' hearts with his portrayal of Bert, the charming chimney sweep. His performance in Chitty Chitty Bang Bang further solidified his status as a beloved figure in film. Throughout his career, Dick Van Dyke has remained a constant presence in the entertainment industry, transitioning from radio to stage to television and film. His contributions have resonated with generations of audiences, leaving a lasting impact on the tapestry of entertainment. At the impressive age of 98, Dick Van Dyke is still very much an active force in the entertainment industry. 
the actor, who has been gracing our screens for over seven decades, is set to make a guest appearance on the popular soap opera Days of Our Lives. This upcoming role is a testament to his unwavering dedication and passion for his craft, which has remained undiminished despite his advanced age. In addition to his acting pursuits, Van Dyke is also known for his remarkable resilience. In 2023, he was involved in a car accident that resulted in serious injuries. However, instead of letting this setback deter him, it only served to fuel his desire to continue acting and living vibrantly. This indomitable spirit is a true inspiration to many and a shining example of the power of perseverance and determination. Van Dyke's commitment to his health and well-being is also noteworthy. Despite his age, he remains active in the gym, and his zest for life is evident to all who know him. His continued involvement in the entertainment industry is a reflection of his enduring passion for storytelling and his desire to connect with audiences of all ages. In conclusion, Dick Van Dyke's long and storied career is a testament to his talent, dedication, and resilience. Even at 98, he shows no signs of slowing down, and his upcoming role on Days of Our Lives is just the latest chapter in this classic actor's remarkable journey. Dick Van Dyke is not just a beloved actor, but also a dedicated activist. Beyond his successful career in entertainment, he has been a vocal advocate for civil rights. In 1968, he reread a powerful speech by Rod Serling at a rally, using his platform to promote equality and justice. The actor's activism extends to charity work as well. He has actively participated in efforts to support the Malibu Labor Center, a community organization that aims to improve the lives of working class families. His dedication to giving back is evident in his work with the National Reyes Syndrome Foundation, a cause close to his heart after the loss of his granddaughter to the disease. Van Dyke has served as a spokesperson for the foundation, raising awareness and funds to support research and education about Reyes Syndrome. His efforts have made a significant impact in the lives of many families affected by the disease. In addition to his activism, Dick Van Dyke is also known for his classic roles in film and television. From his iconic performance in Mary Poppins to his hit TV show The Dick Van Dyke Show, his work has captivated audiences for generations. Despite his many accomplishments, Van Dyke remains humble and dedicated to making a difference in the world. His enduring legacy as an actor and activist continues to inspire and resonate with people of all ages. Whether through his classic roles or his activism, his impact is truly remarkable. It's clear that Dick Van Dyke's contributions to both entertainment and social justice will continue to be cherished for years to come. With that, he continues to step in and make a difference wherever he can. Dick Van Dyke, the beloved actor, is known for his commitment to charity. His philanthropic efforts have made a significant impact over the years. Van Dyke has been volunteering at a local homeless shelter for several decades, dedicating his time and energy to help those in need. His selfless acts of kindness extend beyond the shelter, as he has been spotted spontaneously handing out money to job seekers outside the Malibu Labor Center. For many years, Van Dyke has been a regular volunteer at the Midnight Mission, a homeless shelter located in downtown Los Angeles. He has served meals, shared stories, and offered support to those struggling to get back on their feet. His dedication to the cause has inspired many, and his presence at the shelter has brought joy and hope to those who need it most. In addition to his work at the Midnight Mission, Van Dyke has been known to hand out money to job seekers outside the Malibu Labor Center. The actor understands the struggles of those looking for work and wants to do his part to help. His spontaneous acts of kindness have made a difference in the lives of many, providing them with a sense of hope and encouragement during difficult times. Dick Van Dyke's philanthropic efforts serve as an inspiration to all. His commitment to charity and his willingness to help those in need have made a significant impact on the lives of many. The actor's selfless acts of kindness serve as a reminder that even the smallest gestures can make a big difference. At the age of 98, Dick Van Dyke is still very much active in the acting industry. The actor has two upcoming projects that fans can look forward to. Firstly, he is set to appear in the long-running soap opera days of our lives. While details about his role have yet to be revealed, his involvement alone is already generating excitement among viewers. In addition to his TV appearance, Van Dyke is also set to take on a lead role in the feature film Capture the Flag. Currently in pre-production, the movie promises to be an exciting adventure that will showcase the actor's talent and charm. 
the enduring career and vibrant life of Dick Van Dyke at 98 raises questions about the potential longevity of acting careers. It invites audience reflection on the evolving nature of celebrity and performance in older age. As Van Dyke continues to take on new roles, he challenges the stereotype that aging should equate to retirement or inactivity. Fans of this classic actor can take inspiration from his career and his zest for life. His upcoming projects serve as a reminder that age should not be a barrier to pursuing one's passion and continuing to contribute to the industry. With his talent and dedication, Van Dyke continues to captivate audiences and leave a lasting impact on the world of acting. In the world of entertainment, few names shine as brightly as Dick Van Dyke. Born on December 13, 1925, in West Plains, Missouri, Van Dyke's career has spanned over seven decades, leaving an indelible mark on both stage and screen. After serving in the United States Army during World War II, Van Dyke found his true calling in show business. He began his career as a radio announcer and soon transitioned to television where he would find his greatest success. In 1961, Van Dyke landed the lead role in the hit television series The Dick Van Dyke Show. The show was a critical and commercial success, earning Van Dyke several Emmy Awards for his portrayal of Rob Petrie, a comedy writer for a variety show. But Van Dyke's talents weren't limited to just acting and comedy. He was also an accomplished dancer and singer, showcasing his skills in numerous productions, including the beloved film Mary Poppins. His performances Burke, The Charming Chimney Sweep, earned him a Golden Globe Award and an Academy Award nomination. Throughout his career, Van Dyke has continued to entertain audiences with his wit, charm, and versatility. He has appeared in numerous films, television shows, and stage productions, earning a reputation as one of the most beloved and respected actors in the industry. In addition to his work in entertainment, Van Dyke has also been an advocate for various charitable causes, including the Midnight Mission, a homeless shelter in Los Angeles. Now in his 90s, Van Dyke continues to inspire and entertain audiences with his positive attitude and enduring talent. His contributions to the world of entertainment have left a lasting legacy that will be cherished for generations to come. Born on December 13, 1925, in West Plains, Missouri, Dick Van Dyke was the son of a traveling salesman. The family moved frequently during his childhood, finally settling in Danville, Illinois. It was here that Van Dyke discovered his love for performing thanks to his sister's influence. She was part of a local theater group, and he would often tag along to her rehearsals and performances. Van Dyke's first taste of fame came in high school when he won a Charlie McCarthy ventriloquist dummy in a local talent contest. He began performing with the dummy at various events around town, which led to his decision to pursue a career in radio after graduation. While working as a radio announcer in Danville, Van Dyke met Phil Erickson, who became his mentor and close friend. Erickson introduced him to the world of comedy and encouraged him to hone his skills as a comedian. In 1947, Van Dyke followed Erickson to California, where they formed a comedy team called Eric and Van the Merry Mutes. Despite their success, Van Dyke soon realized that he wanted to focus on acting rather than comedy. He began taking acting classes and landed his first professional acting job in 1949, playing the role of a chimney sweep in a stage production of The Wizard of Oz. Throughout his career, Van Dyke has credited several people with influencing his path as an actor. One of his earliest influences was Stan Laurel of the comedy duo Laurel and Hardy. Van Dyke has said that he learned a lot about physical comedy from watching their films. Another significant influence on Van Dyke's career was actor Spencer Tracy. Van Dyke has said that he admired Tracy's ability to convey so much emotion with just a look or a simple gesture. He also credits Tracy with teaching him the importance of preparation and professionalism on set. In the early 1950s, Van Dyke met Carl Rayner, who became another important mentor. Rayner cast Van Dyke in his first major television role on The Phil Silver Show, and later created the classic sitcom The Dick Van Dyke Show with him. Throughout his long and successful career, Dick Van Dyke has remained grateful for the mentors and influences who helped him along the way. From his early days as a radio announcer to his current status as a beloved actor and entertainer, Van Dyke's passion for performing has never wavered. Ever since Dick Van Dyke was a young boy, he was drawn to the world of entertainment. He loved to make people laugh and put on a show. At the age of 12, he discovered his passion for dancing after seeing a tap dance performance at a local theater. He was so captivated by the dancers' movements and energy that he decided to give it a try himself. 
Dick started taking dance lessons and quickly discovered that he had a natural talent for it. He spent hours practicing and perfecting his technique. By the time he was a teenager, he was already performing in local dance clubs and shows. But it wasn't just dancing that drew Dick to the world of entertainment. He also had a passion for acting and singing. He would put on shows for his family and friends, performing skits and singing songs that he wrote himself. After high school, Dick decided to pursue a career in entertainment. He moved to New York City and started performing in nightclubs and on Broadway. He quickly gained a reputation as a talented and versatile performer. One of Dick's pivotal experiences came when he was cast in the lead role of the musical Bye Bye Birdie. The show was a huge success, and Dick's performance was praised by critics and audiences alike. He was soon offered a contract with a major Hollywood studio and went on to star in a number of successful films and television shows. Throughout his long and successful career, Dick has remained passionate about his craft. He continues to perform and entertain audiences, always striving to create something new and exciting, and he still loves to make people laugh, just like he did when he was a young boy. In the end, it was that early spark of creativity and passion for entertainment that has fueled Dick Van Dyke's desire to pursue a career in the arts. He has left an indelible mark on the world of entertainment, and his legacy will continue to inspire future generations of performers. Dick Van Dyke, a name synonymous with charm and comedic genius, faced numerous obstacles in his early career. Born on December 13, 1925, in West Plains, Missouri, Van Dyke's family moved around frequently due to his father's work as a salesman. This nomadic childhood made it difficult for young Van Dyke to establish roots and friendships. As he pursued his passion for entertainment, Van Dyke struggled financially. He once lived in his car and even resorted to selling tickets for local events to make ends meet. Despite these hardships, he never lost sight of his dream. Van Dyke's resilience and determination led him to perform in various venues, honing his craft and slowly gaining recognition. The entertainment industry was not always welcoming to Van Dyke. Early in his career, he faced skepticism from industry professionals who questioned his talent and suitability for leading roles. Rather than becoming disheartened, Van Dyke used these doubts as motivation to prove them wrong. He worked tirelessly to improve his skills and broaden his range, eventually winning over even his harshest critics. One of the most significant challenges Van Dyke faced was his severe stammer. This speech impediment made it difficult for him to deliver lines convincingly, threatening his chances of success in the acting world. In an act of creativity and resilience, Van Dyke sought help from a speech therapist and developed a unique solution he incorporated his stutter into his performances, turning it into a comedic quirk that became one of his trademarks. Throughout his career, Dick Van Dyke has demonstrated an unwavering commitment to his craft and an ability to overcome adversity. His story serves as a testament to the power of perseverance and the importance of believing in oneself, even in the face of skepticism and hardship. In 1959, Dick Van Dyke's career reached a turning point when he was offered the lead role in the comedy series The Dick Van Dyke Show. This show became a groundbreaking project that showcased his exceptional comedic talents and versatility as an actor. It was a hit with both audiences and critics, earning him three Emmy Awards. Critics praised Van Dyke's performance, with one reviewer from the New York Times noting, Mr. Van Dyke's performance is a textbook example of perfect comic timing. His co-star, Mary Tyler Moore, also spoke highly of him, saying, Dick was the heart and soul of the show. He made everyone around him better. In 1964, Van Dyke took on a more serious role in the film Mary Poppins, which became a critical and commercial success. His performance as Bert, the charming and charismatic chimney sweep, earned him a Golden Globe Award and an Academy Award nomination. Critics and audiences alike were captivated by his performance, with one critic from Variety calling it a delightful and memorable portrayal. Van Dyke's impact on the entertainment industry is undeniable, as his peers and collaborators have noted, his talent, versatility, and dedication to his craft have left a lasting legacy. His work continues to resonate with audiences today, and his contributions to the world of entertainment will be cherished for generations to come. Dick Van Dyke, a beloved actor and performer, is known for his unique comedic style and infectious energy. His artistic vision is deeply rooted in his belief in the power of laughter and the importance of entertaining audiences. Van Dyke's approach to his work is characterized by a commitment to authenticity and a dedication to mastering his craft. One of the key elements of Van Dyke's style is his physical comedy. 
With his elastic facial expressions and fluid movements, he is able to bring a sense of playfulness and lightness to his roles. This is evident in his iconic performance in Mary Poppins, in which he dances and sings with an exuberance that captivates audiences of all ages. Another defining aspect of Van Dyke's work is his ability to connect with audiences on a personal level. He has a knack for infusing his characters with a warmth and humanity that makes them relatable and endearing. This is particularly evident in his portrayal of Rob Petrie on The Dick Van Dyke Show, in which he expertly balances humor and heart. Van Dyke's personal experiences and worldview are also reflected in his work. Growing up during the Great Depression, he developed a deep appreciation for the power of laughter to lift spirits and bring people together. This perspective is evident in his commitment to using his platform to spread joy and positivity, in addition to his work as an actor. Van Dyke is also a talented musician and dancer. He often incorporates these skills into his performances, adding an extra layer of depth and complexity to his work. This versatility has allowed him to enjoy a long and successful career spanning decades and encompassing a wide range of genres and mediums. In conclusion, Dick Van Dyke's artistic vision and process are characterized by a commitment to authenticity, a dedication to mastering his craft, and a belief in the power of laughter to bring people together. His unique style and approach have made him a beloved figure in the world of entertainment, and his work continues to resonate with audiences today. Dick Van Dyke's impact and influence on the entertainment industry are significant and far-reaching. With a career spanning over seven decades, he has left an indelible mark on television, film, and theater. In the 1960s, Van Dyke's self-titled show, The Dick Van Dyke Show, revolutionized sitcoms with its innovative storytelling and groundbreaking humor. The show's creator, Carl Reiner, once said, Dick Van Dyke was the center of everything. His talent, his charm, and his comedic timing were unmatched. Van Dyke's physical comedy skills, including his iconic pratfalls and rubber-faced expressions, have influenced countless performers. Jim Carrey, a renowned physical comedian himself, has cited Van Dyke as a significant influence on his own career. In addition to his work in television, Van Dyke has made a significant impact on the film industry. His role as Burke in the classic film Mary Poppins introduced a new generation to his talents and endeared him to audiences of all ages. Julie Andrews, who starred alongside Van Dyke in the film, has said, Dick Van Dyke is a national treasure. His talent and generosity are unparalleled. Van Dyke's contributions to the entertainment industry extend beyond his on-screen work. He is also an accomplished singer, dancer, and musician. His performances in musicals such as Bye Bye Birdie and Chitty Chitty Bang Bang have showcased his versatility and range as a performer. Despite his many accolades and achievements, Van Dyke remains humble and dedicated to his craft. At 96 years old, he continues to perform and inspire new generations of performers. As industry expert and historian, Leonard Malton has said, Dick Van Dyke is a true legend. His contributions to the entertainment industry are immeasurable, and his influence will be felt for generations to come. Dick Van Dyke, a beloved actor and entertainer, leads a life full of joy and purpose outside of the spotlight. He values family and friendship, often spending time with his wife, Arlene Silver, and their blended family. Van Dyke's love for music and dance, which he showcased in his iconic role in Mary Poppins, remains a significant part of his life. He often performs with his jazz band, the Vantatix, bringing happiness to audiences of all ages. Philanthropy plays a significant role in Van Dyke's life. He is passionate about various causes, including supporting children's hospitals and advocating for those with disabilities. Notably, he has been involved with the Mid-City Los Angeles Community Center, which provides essential services to underserved communities. Van Dyke's personal values of compassion and generosity are evident in his philanthropic efforts. In his professional work, Van Dyke brings positivity and enthusiasm, reflecting his genuine personality, his passion for music and dance, as well as his commitment to making a difference in the world, shine through in every project he undertakes. Dick Van Dyke, a true icon of the entertainment industry, leaves behind a legacy of versatility and comedic brilliance. With a career spanning over six decades, he has captivated audiences on stage, television, and film. From his groundbreaking work on The Dick Van Dyke Show to his memorable performance in Mary Poppins, his impact on the industry is indelible. For aspiring professionals, Van Dyke offers invaluable advice. He emphasizes the importance of hard work, persistence, and staying true to oneself. 
Find what you love to do and work hard at it, he says. Don't worry about what other people think. If you're passionate about it, that will shine through. Van Dyke also stresses the value of adaptability in an ever-changing industry. Things are always changing in this business, he notes. You have to be willing to learn and grow, to try new things and take risks. As for his own future contributions, Van Dyke remains open to new opportunities. I'm not ready to retire yet, he says. There are still so many things I want to do, so many stories I want to tell. I'm excited to see what the future holds. In the end, Dick Van Dyke's legacy serves as a shining example for aspiring professionals. His work ethic, creativity, and passion for storytelling have left an indelible mark on the industry, inspiring generations to come. Dick Van Dyke's journey in the entertainment industry is a testament to his unwavering passion and innovation. Born on December 13, 1925, Van Dyke started his career as a radio announcer before transitioning to television and film. His groundbreaking comedy show, The Dick Van Dyke Show, which aired from 1961 to 1966, showcased his innovative comedic timing and physical comedy, leaving a lasting impact on the sitcom genre. Throughout his career, Van Dyke has taken on various roles, from musicals like Mary Poppins and Chitty Chitty Bang Bang to dramatic performances in the comic and Diagnosis Murder. His versatility and commitment to his craft have earned him numerous accolades, including five Emmy Awards and a Grammy Award. Despite facing personal and professional challenges, Van Dyke's creativity and perseverance have allowed him to continue to captivate audiences for over seven decades. His impact on the entertainment industry is undeniable, inspiring generations of performers and delighting fans of all ages. In the end, Dick Van Dyke's story is a powerful reminder of the importance of creativity and perseverance. His ability to adapt and innovate has left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry, proving that with passion and hard work, anyone can make a lasting impact. As we celebrate the life and career of Dick Van Dyke, it's impossible not to be amazed by his versatility. From his early days on the Dick Van Dyke show to his iconic role in Mary Poppins, he has brought joy to countless audiences. His comedic timing is impeccable, and his singing and dancing skills are unmatched. Who can forget his famous Chim Sherry performance or his energetic tap dancing in Bye Bye Birdie? But beyond his talent, Van Dyke is known for his kindness and generosity. He has been a dedicated advocate for various charities and has used his platform to make a positive impact. As we reflect on his impressive body of work, we would love to hear your thoughts. What are your favorite Dick Van Dyke roles or moments? Share your memories and favorite performances in the comments below. And if you enjoy this content, please like and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe for more celebrations of the creative spirits shaping entertainment. Together, let's continue to honor and appreciate the legacy of Dick Van Dyke and other talented